Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. He's the silky smooth crooner who reminded us of what romance feels like mm -hmm. with his hit song, Keep You In Mind. And with a certified hit record in his arsenal, he's released new music and is crowning himself the Prince of Soul. Take Watch out now. And listen. <laughs> Entertainment. Please welcome Jordan Banks. Yes. All right. How are you doing? How you doing? Great. How are you? We're doing just fine. You came down here all nice and silky. What you got on right there? What you wearing? This is mirror. Mirror loungewear, nightwear, loungewear, yachtwear, vibewear. Oh, yachtwear. You hang out on yachts? Yeah, nightwear. Boy, you too smooth. I can not tell you. So. We're not the only one who thinks, you, who thinks you're smooth. So Hot New Hip Hop also crowned you Best Dress at the Soul Train Awards. Mm. Yes. Mm. What, what you have on at the Soul Train Awards? Oh, yeah. 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 yeah, that looked good. I think it was the snake. It was the snake that did it. That did it. Oh, yeah, I like yeah, the way yeah, the suit yeah. fits, too. It fits you oh, very well. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. and it could have been the smoking slippers. I like yes. the slippers you have on there. And then your frames look all right, too. You cool. see what I'm saying? You did all right for yourself. <laughs> you did all right for yourself. Now, where did you get your style from? Yeah. My dad. Your dad. My dad, yeah, for sure. He was smooth. He was definitely smooth. Yeah. Someone that um, just knew how to put things together. And mm -hmm. then, you know, my brothers, like, growing up, my sisters would always say that I would say that I matched when I really didn't match. But it was just Did like, you I was just, match? no, I would just put anything going. And every, and I'll be like, you know, I'm, I'm fly, I'm matching. And they'll, they'll be clowning me. But to me, I felt like I was fly. And so I... It's all about how you feel. Right. And that's what, the confidence that's, you yeah, exude, even yeah. though you're wearing pajamas. Exactly. Right. It's all about how you <laughs> feel. Lounge right. wear. Yeah. Where are you but from? I'm from Philadelphia. Okay, okay. my mama Philly. from West Philly. Yeah. Oh, right. I, I, hear the, I hear the right. accent. Yeah. Not yeah. my mama. Yeah, yeah. my mama. Yeah. Yeah. My mama yeah. now. Yeah. I'm from the A, but okay. my mama from West okay. Philly. Yeah, yeah, Philadelphia for yeah. sure. Yeah, I hear it. Okay, now let's talk about this real quick. Mm -hmm. Now, everyone is giving themselves titles nowadays. We got Jacquees Wet, the king of R&B. And do you agree with that? Do I agree with him? You heard the question, Jackie. <laughs> <laughs> he's, his, he's his own king. He's his king of he his said, kingdom. He said he's king of R&B. Come on, of R&B. Yes. Mm -hmm. Of R&B. No. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. You, you found yourself Prince of Soul. Now, why Prince of Soul? Because soul music is like really being swept under the carpet, and it's really something that really drove us as a people, mm -hmm. as a culture. I think. Um, what James Brown and Marvin Gaye did shaped the society, shaped our culture, and really took us to the next level. And the music isn't doing it. It's actually doing the opposite. Think about the things that's happening in the industry. Mm -hmm. Just recently, we just lost someone mm -hmm. that was like in the hip hop world. Yeah, Spice, uh, was, um, Juice World. Juice yeah. World. Yeah. 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 But that's been kind of a trend. And I yeah. think that um, we kind of, I always say the industry should be like a uh, supermarket. You shouldn't tell people what to get. They should be allowed to, to go vegan or get vegetables. Yeah. If they want to do meat or protein, mm -hmm. they should be able to get it. But now it's like, we're just going to force it down your throat. Mm -hmm. So for me, it's like, I need to embrace soul because soul, we need that soul. Right. You well, know, that's what's missing. Right. Well, what's the difference between R&B and soul to you? Uh, the difference between R&B and soul is that sometimes they, they consider Drake R&B or, you know, rappers mm -hmm. R&B. That's not R&B. Mm -hmm. That's just, you know, like rap. That's hip-hop with melody. Mm. You know, soul, you know, you feel it. You feel mm -hmm. it in your gut. You, yeah. you know, yeah. Tony Braxton, the Braxton, <laughs> exactly. that's soul. That's soul. I'm break my heart. Okay. You know, that's, that's soul. You yeah. know, that's R&B. That's yes. soul. Yes. So, yeah. Yes. Well, Definitely. This, this path of music is, is something that is very unique. You wanted to be an attorney. Wow. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, my mother thought that I could talk my way out of any, <laughs> anything. Uh -huh. but she was like, you need to be an attorney. Look at your attorney. attorney. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he was listen, he was fine, though. He had the outfit See, I was good. I'm kind of matching, like. There you go. Wow. Yeah. You know, yeah. and, and in addition to your amazing voice, you all Thank also you. have a strong pen for uh, writing for artists like Keisha Cole, mm. John Legend, Chris yeah. Brown, Layla Hathaway. So how vital is it to have both strengths in singing and writing? It's very it's very vital. Um, I, I feel like the songwriting naturally opened doors for artists mm -hmm. because you're in a room with the artist and then to me to have the voice when you're singing a song and a melody that you want the artist to sing, it's like they hear it and they're like, hold on, maybe you should stay on that part. So that's mm -hmm. how it happened with Meek Mill because mm. I was in the studio with him doing hooks and then we ended up, he ended up keeping the hooks on, ah, on the record. Yeah. Like, you know what, that, 
that sounds good. Yeah. You know, actually, you need to be on my label. And so we we begin to build and work. Mm. And that kind of opened the door for me to be an artist. Yeah. And, and definitely, it. it's definitely important to, if you have that pen to just write, mm -hmm. write, write, yeah. write, write, and mm -hmm. that moment will come. Absolutely. Oh, right. Speaking of right, we'll be right back because we've got right more back. with Jordan Bates. <laughs> 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 nice job. But you'll know both I'm right. And just like that, we are back with the Prince of Soul. Jordan Banks. Yes. 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 Brother, you dropped a new album. Yes, with Blood. Cosmic Caviar. Yeah. Cosmic Blood Cav on the Vinyl. Blood on the Vinyl. Quite oh, yeah. a unique title. Well, it, it goes back to just what I was talking about with soul. I just feel like music is lacking that that passion, and, and you got to go for blood. If you really believe in something and you really believe in a message, you just go for it. And it's Blood on the Vinyl with Cosmic mm -hmm. Caviar. Mm -hmm. So I was in Jamaica when I did... Uh, like half of the music uh, I just do I recorded in Jamaica so it was a vibe it was mm -hmm. it was just a dope energy so. yeah and then you crossed out blood and put Christmas <laughs> on the vinyl <laughs> but I thought that was super dope though yeah thank you but thank what, you. what made you come oh, up with that concept oh, I mean wow. you just crossed it on out and then put a wreath well, on it but I thought I like you <laughs> 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 just crossed it on out and put a wreath on it <laughs> No, honestly, I literally did that album last week in like three really? days. Yeah, so yeah. what's the vibe on it? Just because I'm, I'm, I'm born and raised Baptist, so mm. it's real Christian music, mm. real mm. Christmas music, you know, ho Oh Holy Night, yes. you know, it's just those real soulful yes. Christian vibes. Yes. Yeah. Awesome. Before we let you go, I know that you're very, you're an advocate for making sure that uh, artists in, the, in, in this industry yes. keep their mental health yes. stay yes. important. Yes, uh, so important. Why is that so important to you and how do you make sure you stay centered? Well, it's important because first and foremost, if you have a purpose, it has to be yours. Mm -hmm. It shouldn't be someone else's. It shouldn't be, you know, which, how you feel about how someone else feels about your purpose. So we are all fearfully and wonderfully made. Yes, Everyone yeah, in, individually. Right. Mm -hmm. So why should we worry about how, you know, the mm -hmm. next person is moving and how the next person is living? So love yourself. Keep, keep, Keep God first. Yes, really. yes. You know what I'm saying? And that, that's how you stay sane. That's how you stay grounded. Right, so right, sure. right. Well, we're so happy that you've come yes. down to the circle to share your love. The Prince of Soul, yes. Jordan Banks in his lounge. Wow. And I want my outfit, that's too. Right. I want my initial www.mirabygb.com. And then you can also find all of his music on all digital streaming platforms. Yes. And the conversation always continues. Yes. This is Circle TV on all social media we platforms. We want our outfits, man. Yes. 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 Yes.